This amendment would mandate the Comptroller General carry out a study to determine the adverse effects of allowing biological men to compete in women's sports. It looks at the adverse psychological, developmental, participatory, and sociological results to girls of allowing males to compete, be members of a sports team, or participants in athletic programs that are designed specifically for girls, including hostile environment creation, sexual assault, and sexual harassment. Calling, we're going to call this today the Riley, Riley Gaines Report. And Riley Gaines' lifetime of hard work was undermined by a log biological male who was wrongly allowed to compete against women in NCAA-sanctioned competition. Furthermore, she had to deal with the psychological trauma of being forced to share a locker room and change in front of a biological man. Subjecting more women to this is cruel. All of the glass ceilings that have been shattered by women in sports have been for naught if we allow this to continue. So I'm going to stand with women and fight for their fair right to competition.